In this calculus tutorial, I would like to show you guys the robot equation that you have to use the chain rule five times. And did I make this up? Yes, I did. But anyway, let's have a look. We are going to differentiate the square root of sine of ln of inverse tangent of e to the 2x. It's not so bad, but if you want to try it first, right now it's the time for you to do so. Pause the video and give it a try. Done? Alright, so I got my black pen and red pen. Of course, I also have the purple blue ones and also the green one so let me just get them ready first and here we go so first off we have that square root function so we are going to have 1 over 2 and then square root and then pretty much everything inside just write that down right here right so we have sine of ln of inverse tangent of e to the 2x like so and then 1 2 3 all right, so that's the first part. And then we are going to multiply by the derivative inside. And let me use a blue one to continue. Yeah. Derivative of this, sine of whatever is cosine of whatever, right? So it's cosine of, and then you just write down the inside over again. So ln of inverse tangent of e to the 2x, like so. And as you can see, I ran out of space. So I'm just going to write it down the next line and then it's just all multiplication, right? Then the next one is we are going to differentiate the inner function right here like this. So it's a multiplication. So we multiply. When we differentiate ln of something, it's just 1 over. So we have 1 over the inside pretty much. So we have inverse tangent of e to the 2x like that. Okay, and then next, we are going to differentiate this thing here. And the derivative inverse tangent is 1 over 1 plus that inside thing squared. So we multiply by 1 over 1 plus this thing squared. So parentheses inside is the e to the 2x, and then we have to square that. And then we are going to multiply by the derivative of this. The derivative of that is e to the same thing, so e to the 2x. And lastly, I also run out of colors. So let's just repeat from the original. So here, multiply by the derivative 2x. So multiply by 2, like that. All right, so are we going to simplify it? Uh, we will try. <laughs> so here's the deal. The reason I have this 2x is because this 2 and that 2 cancel out. And um, let's see. So chain rule once, twice, <laughs> three times, four times, and fifth times. Chain rule five times, and this two and that two, they cancel 